the basics of, of recognising good light, good natural light, are still the same as when people were painting in 1600. How did you get on, Matt? Captured it. Yes, yep. Captured You're getting a workout as well here, <laughs> walking up this hill. And Claire said, dust. I want you to understand um, which kind of natural light is best for a portrait of a person. That's because his face is flat. Can you see any shadows? Think about that. Don't move your head, Matt. Um, okay, it's not far off it. The shadow side of Matt's face is not as dark as it was before, and the highlight side is not flat. You two guys can swap. Bill and Ian can swap. Shoot, 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 and ask. That's what I'm ask me. That goes messy, but that's nice. And that's. You're, moody, you're a bit moody. Yeah? Yeah. Catch yeah. right. Oh, yeah. That's, oh, that's beautiful. Mm. Tell you what, that's a lot better. So you've looked at your backgrounds, got a nice, plain, clear, and simple background. Mm. Is everyone happy that they've put into practice some of the things that we talked about? It's more even light, and there's still some shadow, but it's gentler shadow, so it shapes the face nicely, but it's not too harsh, and that actually suits really well. Thank you. Thank you, Claire. Thanks very much. Okay, good luck. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay. Thanks very much. Enjoy oh, it. Good. I'm so glad. Thank That's you. So... Oh, go okay, just in case. <laughs> it's been a real pleasure. Thank no, no, it's been so really much good. Thank you so much for lots of good input and good no, ideas welcome. as well.